Okay. And the first song, hello to my papa and my nana. This is family treasure hunt. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh no! Oh no! What's wrong, Pee Wee? What? What did you say? What's wrong, Pee Wee? Don't be scared, Pee Wee. Trust God to get you through it. You can tell God you were scared and he will help you. I know a true story from the Bible that will help you to trust God to get you through it. He gets you through anything that scares you. The story's from Exodus chapter 14 and it goes like this. Moses and God's chosen people, the Israelites, were running away from Egypt because it was dangerous for them there. There were about a million people and they were going to a new land that God had promised they could live in. They did not know the way. So God showed them the way to this new land and he kept them safe. On and on they walked through the desert until they reached the edge of a great big sea called the Red Sea. Oh no, they said, how are we going to get across? Then they looked behind them and saw the Egyptian army with chariots and horses and weapons chasing after them. They were trapped and they were scared. Why were they like scared? You, Why were they scared? Well, the Egyptians were very angry and the Israelites, uh, they were very angry that the Israelites had left and they were angry because the Israelites used to be their slaves and had to do all the horrible jobs that the Egyptians didn't want to do. So the Egyptians wanted to catch them and make them the slaves again. That's right, Kate. So the Israelites were frightened that if the Egyptian army caught up with them, many of them would be killed. So they were terrified. Can you imagine how scared they were? They stood by the sea, shaking with fear, and they cried out to God. So Moses said to the people, don't be scared, trust God to get you through it. Don't be scared, trust God to get you through it. God told Moses to lift up his staff, which is like a big stick, and stretch out his hand over the sea and God promised that if Moses did that, God would move the sea and create a dry path so that the Israelites could walk across the sea on dry land. Nah, that's impossible. You can't move the sea. I know because I've tried. <laughs> Have you, Pee Wee? Well, Pee Wee, <clears throat> you're, you're right and you're wrong. You see, for people, it is impossible to move the sea, well, that much sea, anyway, and to make a dry path across it. But nothing is impossible for God, because he made the sea and he made the land. Now Moses trusted God, so he did what God said. He lifted his staff and he stretched out his hand over the sea and God sent a very, very strong wind which blew the sea apart. The sea piled up on, in two walls of water, either side of a dry path. Whoa, that's amazing! It really is. The Israelites, walked through the sea on dry ground with a wall of water on their left and a wall of water on their right. But then the Egyptians followed them. Oh no! Did the Egyptians catch them? No. No way! You're right, Ethan. They closed it before, they closed the sea before they, um, before they caught them. Yeah. 
That's right. Well done. <laughs> when the Israelites got safely to the other side of the sea, God told Moses to again lift up his staff and stretch out his hand over the water. Moses trusted God. So he did what God said. And the walls of water came crashing down upon the Egyptian army, covering the dry path and covering the Egyptian army. What? The Israelites were safe. God got them safely through the desert and through the sea. They were no longer slaves in Egypt. And they didn't have to be scared anymore. Wow! That's amazing! Oh, God is so powerful. I think it's amazing that God listened to their cry for help and then he did all those things to get the Israelites to a safe place. If God can do that for them, then I know he can definitely help me when I'm scared. That's right, Pee Wee. And I'm pleased to hear that. Because if God could save them from the Egyptian army, and get them across the Red Sea on dry land, then we can definitely trust God when we are scared. Now, boys and girls at home, what are you scared of? Maybe you're scared of the coronavirus. And getting lost. Maybe you're scared of getting lost, like Ethan. And you <laughs> losing me while I was just hiding behind the tree. <laughs> getting lost again. <laughs> Whatever you're scared of, you can trust God to get you through it. If God has the power to get the Israelites across the Red Sea, he definitely has the power to help you and to help me when we are scared. So let's pray. Let's ask God to help us not to be scared, but to trust God. Should we close our eyes and pray? Dear powerful God, maker of the seas and the land and the wind, we pray that you will help us to trust you when we're scared and know that you have the power to get us through. And we pray for all the nanas and grandpas, grandmas and granddads who are also feeling a bit scared and all the mummies and daddies. Please help them to trust you, God, to get them through whatever is scaring them. We thank you that you love us and you have the power to do it. Amen. 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 Now, we've re recorded a few of these family treasure hunts now. So, mums and dads, if you are watching these with your children, we would love you to send us a message. Uh, you might have our personal uh, uh, emails or phone numbers. That would be great. If not, please contact the St Paul's Camford Heath church office and we would love to hear that you are watching because we will carry on recording them if they are useful um and now i think it must be time for a treasure hunt oh yeah. yes it's gone treasure. Yeah. So, treasure imagine hunt. imagine you are an israelite and you are leaving egypt and moving to a new home in a new land what Five treasures would you take with you? So our treasure hunt today is to find five treasures you would take with you to your new home. Are you ready, treasure hunters? Woohoo! Let's Get go ready. treasure hunting! Let's go! Yeah. Bye. 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 Bye.